Hi. Getting back into pronouns today, and I want to talk about interrogative pronouns. Interrogative pronouns are pronouns that interrogate or ask questions. And there are five of them. Who, whom, whose, what, and which. So I might say, what are you doing? But I also might say, whatever are you doing? So these pronouns may have ever stuck to them. But these are the main five. Who, whom, whose, what, and which. Now, we have trouble with some of these. One of the ones we have trouble with is whose. And the reason we have trouble with whose is because there's another word, whose. W-H-O apostrophe S. And that is a contraction for who is. So who is actually the pronoun you're using there, not whose. So if you have a sentence, you hear somebody say, whose book is that? Can you say, who is book is, is that? No. So it's not who apostrophe is. It's whose, W-H-O-S-E. And that's how you can do it. Just take the whose and determine whether you can make that contraction out of it. The other ones that we have trouble with are who and whom. We tend to get who right most of the time, but when the word needs to be whom, a lot of times we won't say whom. And I've noticed that when people do say whom, they even get it wrong then. Personally, I don't care much for the word whom. It sounds uppity, but it is what it is, and we have to use it. And whom is used in the same way that we use him, her, me, us, them. Whereas who is used in the way that we use he, she, I, we, they. We would say who is going to the store with you because who is doing the acting. But we would say, I mean, the same way as we would say he is going to the store with you. But we would say with whom are you going to the store? because you're doing the acting now. In the same way that we would say, you're going to store with him, you're going to the store with whom. If the person receives the action, then it's whom. If the person does the action, then it's who. Now these can be used as adjectives, as in whose brother is that, whose modifies brother, or it, they can be used to, just to stand for a noun, like, whose is that? And um, I think that's it. <laughs> Bye.